We did it. We did it, Ralph. You're going to be the first black senator of Georgia. And so to everyone out there struggling today, whether you voted for me or not, know this. I hear you. I see you. And every day I'm in the United States Senate, I will fight for you. Say, hey, you all see it? You see it? So they got on their new PJs. Their big girl PJs. Look, this is the method we got for Jory for Christmas. So she can practice. Doing some tummy time on this. Hey, Jory, you ready, mama? Yeah. Say, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. You ready? Okay, let's put Jory on here. Wow, Jory. Yeah. Careful, careful. Hey, Jory. Hey, Mama. Look. Woom. 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 Wow, wow, wow. Okay. Now you gotta press. You gotta press up. Wow. Mmm. Mmm. Like it help up oh, broccoli broccoli green green what you got mmm mmm you need some hot chocolate now they starting to take the spoon and put it in the cup because they eat hot chocolate now or drink hot chocolate rather trying to move trying to move George definitely gonna be crawling soon Cause your sister's turned two, but guess what? Now we can tell everybody, well they already knew, but happy five months, Jory. Happy five months, Angel. Y'all know she was born on the 28th, the girls were born on the 28th, so when they turned two, Jory turned five months. Uh-oh, you okay, baby? You like your new PJs? Can you show them your house shoes? You like your new house shoes? Show them your house shoes that you got for Christmas. Shoes, there we go, girl. Look at these. So whenever they leave out the room, they put on their nice shoes. Yes, thank you, Journey. You got yours too, Angel? Yes, thank you. Th hey. Oh, 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 look at mm -hmm. Hey, Jory. Hey, Jory. Hey, Jory. And now a word from our sponsor. Okay, guys. So I'm about to take all of my vitamins for the day. And I wanted to show you guys the cute package that it comes in with my nice message right here. Can you all read that? It's so sweet. So you all are probably wondering, like, how do I have all of my vitamins for the day in this cute um, package that actually has my name on it? And I actually got this from a company by the name of Care Of. I'm so happy you guys i'm so freaking happy that i'm partnering with them and i'm working with them because i have to tell you guys about this company i absolutely love them so these vitamins allow me to check off some realistic goals such as minimizing stress in a healthy way immune support at a time like this it is very very important and i know you guys are probably wondering how do i select these vitamins of choice because i have a few i'm gonna tell you guys what i have um but it's because they have a holistic quiz that you can take as soon as you get to their website and they ask you a bunch of different questions um, of things that are most specific to you and at the end of the quiz it recommends a ton of different products um, that will be beneficial for you and these are the products that I got so they also send you a cute little book so you cannot go wrong you will always know what, what type of ingredients are in your products 
um and just like a step by step of everything you guys and i absolutely love that so i did get another protein powder which was recommended i got a plant protein powder because i definitely talked about throughout the quiz that i was trying to gain some more muscle you guys know i'm working out so i got this um plant protein powder and like i said it goes over all the ingredients you tell them about your type of lifestyle you're living what products you're eating things you're trying to avoid if you're pregnant if you're nursing things like that you guys they cover it all so yes you guys i have this protein powder which is bomb and i absolutely love it because um i also got this cup right here which i've never had anything like this before i thought this was like um i was like did they mistakenly put this in my cup so you guys this actually is it helps you mix your beverage so all i have to do is add in my protein powder my almond milk my ice and i can shake it up and this literally mixes it so well and then i can just take it with me to go so i absolutely love this cup now like i said these are my vitamins of the day so the vitamins that i got was some fish oil which helps to maintain a healthy heart um and it tells you how many you should be taking i also got a prenatal um, which supports pregnancy or if after you've given um, birth it's always recommended to continue taking your pre um, prenatal vitamins and then i also got a calcium plus which is to, um supports bone health so i absolutely love that now another benefit that i love after taking the holistic quiz you guys do not have to worry because it is very convenient they will actually be shipping your products to you monthly so you don't even have to worry about it so you guys i want you all to take time to think about what types of things you all are doing these small victories throughout the new year what types of things are you guys doing to just be a better version of yourself just be healthier um that could just be as simple as starting your day with these new vitamin and supplements that are recommended for you so like i said click the link in my description box to take the quiz and see which products and supplements care of recommends for you and get 50 percent off of your order with my coupon code okay guys happy new year this is the very first vlog of the new year so excited um today is a very special day it's a big day um and it is jory's helmet day so she already got fit um for a helmet a few weeks ago and today is the day that she actually gets it on um she has to wear it for nine weeks 23 hours a day so they only recommend that you take it off probably around bath time so you know it can be comfortable for them to you know interact and get clean or whatever during that time but other than that you guys she will be wearing her helmet i met a few of the other moms and the other babies with their helmet that vary with different ages here um i loved this facility i absolutely like my doctors well their doctor's office rather um recommended this place and i absolutely love it their um, facility is just 10 out of 10 hands down customer service 10 out of 10 hands down like i just absolutely love this entire process and the experience and like i said i talked to some of the other moms and um they had a lot of positive things to say about this whole journey um all the kids seem to be really happy um because you know I, I, of course as a parent you're just concerned like my baby has to wear this helmet i don't want them to be uncomfortable or you know how is it trying to hold them and console them and still give them that unconditional love and you know um everyone just had so many positive things to say so i'm really excited now look at miss mama herself you guys haven't seen well you all probably have seen her on the gram but y'all jory is big <laughs> she has gained so much new year weight you guys from the holidays this girl is eating up a storm we had to increase her um bottle um serving per feed and we actually had to introduce solids twice out of the day rather than just once out of the day so look at Miss Chunkers herself. So she does have a lot of curly hair and they had recommended that we kind of cut it, but they said, oh, here's the doctor. Hey. hey, how's everyone doing? Everything is great. Awesome. We're ready. Happy New, Happy New Year. All right, let's have a little sleep. Oh, okay, let's see. Try it. Oh, I know, mama, I know. I know you sleepy baby. Oh. Yeah, as far as yeah, the stress times of stress or okay. Like, but now, but now down the road, you know, once she's been in the bath for a little while, uh -huh. we're gonna want a report card, so okay. we may just slick it down. But it's gonna be open face. Okay, okay, perfect. Oh. And then we can undo her jacket. Okay. 
but I'll see how it, how it fits on the neck. Hello. Okay. You're like, where am I? <laughs> where am I? She's looking at everything. Oh no, she's so she's curious. Okay, so here's the um, front of the back. There's a point right there. Mm -hmm. You're always going to align it with the nose, let it rest just above the eyebrows, okay? Okay. All right, so I'm just going to try it. Let's get, like I said, I could be a little bit long, okay? Okay. Don't worry. Hey, Mama. Say hey. Was that comfortable? Is that comfortable, pretty girl? Thank you, my hair off your face. Oh. Y'all, literally, y'all should have seen us on the day it was time for her to get fit for this. Because her hair literally is so curly, it would not slick down for nothing. Like, I was getting so nervous and apprehensive because he was like, if they don't approve the scan that they sent in, um, she would either A, have to come back in here and try to do it again and slick her, down, slick her hair down, or B, like, have to cut some of the sides of her hair off. Luckily, we got it down, y'all. Literally, I had to take some. They had some products here. Luckily with some ethnic products as well. And then some water and I had brought a brush just in case. And I had put this little hat, little thingy on her head to like try to keep it down. But we got it through. We got it through. You excited? You excited? So um, I also scheduled them their eye doctor appointment to see if Journey will need some glasses. Um, so that's actually next week. So I'm really excited to see because you guys we have really been introducing a lot of stuff from um, What their teacher recommended and doing a lot of different learning activities and the more and more activities that she does like we're monitoring and looking at how She's um, reading and holding objects and she does continuously like whenever it's something reading or some fine print or even any type of word We're noticing that she's definitely um, um put holding things close hello um but yeah so you guys like i said happy new year hope you guys are having a great start to your year we have made it to our next destination hold on y'all which is ulta we gotta run in here really quickly and get some stuff that um i gotta get a new lip pencil and a sharpener because Journey, y'all know she likes drawing and writing, y'all. And she freaking, I'm gonna make sure it's focused. <laughs> she literally just found all my pencils and had her way with writing over here. So, let's just come in here and find a brown pencil. Hey guys, so I am at my laser appointment now. This is appointment number, is this three or four? I, I think it's four, you guys, I pay for eight. So I think we have made it to four. Um, let me show you all, hold on, wait. I'm trying to figure out how to show y'all. Dang, hold on, I gotta figure this out real quick. How to show, oh, hold on, let me just take my sleeve out and then try to show y'all my underarm. So this is how my underarm is looking. I can't show y'all my bikini area, but this is how it's looking. No hair, really smooth. Like I said, I'm absolutely loving this, um, this entire process. Hands down, I definitely recommend laser over wax any day. Like I definitely prefer it, especially since they can numb you. And yeah, so I have a new um, lady who's gonna be doing it today. So um, yes, yeah, so I, I guess when she comes in, I'll check in and let you guys know exactly the update of pain levels and everything like that. We got one, two, three.
thought that was it. That for one section. Oh, okay. Yeah. I literally just snatched I'm trying to get all the hair out of my face but I literally just snatched my lashes off so excuse my naked eyes but I have not vlogged all day today um, I was busy handling business and by business I mean trying to get this intro together for you guys I was kind of stumped I had a few different creative concepts but due to the weather it was messing your girl up so we had to think of something else at the last second hopefully it went great I'll know once he gets home and edit it um, and then if not we're gonna have to reshoot tomorrow which today was already like a whole day dedicated to it so you guys but anyways I am about to tackle dinner I just got this butter Hold on, you guys. I probably need just a little bit more I'm about to make some stuffed chicken I've been doing really really good you guys in this new year if y'all been following me on the gram y'all probably seen a few of my meals my breakfast and my dinners but um yeah I've been trying to make sure I stay consistent because your girl kind of fell off after I gave birth I was eating good while I was pregnant but after I gave birth I kind of fell off so let me show y'all exactly what I'm about to do. I'm gonna just add some of this mint garlic to it. Who adds like seasonings to their vegetables? <laughs> Are we kind of like defeating the purpose of eating healthy when we're adding all these freaking seasonings that includes a lot of salts and stuff? But you know, I'm definitely guilty as charged. So I'm just gonna add some spinach. I'm trying to make enough for tomorrow because my goal is to cook a fresh meal, breakfast, lunch, and dinner um, every day. But sometimes I can't get around to cooking a fresh lunch meal, um, especially with the girls and like they're dedicating my time around their schedule and everything. So it is easier if I have some leftovers from dinner to give to them. We've been trying to give them chicken a little bit more. They're still a little indifferent about it, um, but they're still eating um, other forms of protein for you guys out there wondering like, oh my gosh, what are they eating for protein? Um, we're gonna film a day in the life of the girls meal soon. Um, so you guys can kind of get the gist of what they eat, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I don't know if I wanna do like a day or a week's worth of meals. Y'all know spinach once it cooks down. It literally, so I think that should be enough. So yeah, my oven is ready. I got some macaroni and cheese and I got some potatoes, my infamous potatoes. And here is the chicken, hold on y'all. So here's the chicken right here, already pre-seasoned. So it's been marinating for a little bit. Y'all, this smells bomb.com. So this is the perfect, perfect, perfect amount of spinach. And like I said, you're gonna just cook that down. And then you're gonna wanna take out, hold on y'all, let me show y'all. Wait, it was up here. The girl is so short, so it's so hard. I can't even keep up. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Boom. So you're gonna wanna take out one of these bad boys right here and I typically do like to put foil down when I cook so that it just doesn't stick um, I'm pretty sure you can put something else but I just like foil it usually does a trick for me the next step I feel so crazy because I like literally I was like let me come out here and put the chicken in the stove before um, before I wash all my makeup off. Okay, so you're, the next thing you're gonna wanna do is take some cottage cheese and you're gonna mix some cottage cheese. So you guys know I do not really like to touch meat. It's so weird. A lot of people are like that though. And I'm gonna just take this like so. 
with my tongue and you can get some of the liquid in the um, pan so it doesn't dry out as much and then you're gonna probably want to go back over with some seasonings or actually just gonna drizzle the rest of that in this with it I should have showed y'all me seasoning it So I'm gonna just go back and add some more of the roasted garlic and herb. I put a few different seasons in there as well. But this one in particular, I'm gonna go back over it with. And then I'm also going to add in some parsley. Cause parsley just, you know, does what it needs to do. Now I'm going to take my tongs and keep it spread cause I don't wanna touch it. And I mean, you can use gloves, but I don't feel like putting them on. And especially since I'm about to wash my face. Open this right on up. I cooked the perfect amount of spinach, literally. I'm gonna have plenty left for lunch. So this will just be for me for lunch. The girls won't eat the chicken portion. And voila, this is what it looks like. And I'm going to place this in the oven. I'll show you guys how it looks when I'm done. It's not a game, it's a red stick.